Hello students, today's uh, video is on advanced number theory. I pre-selected some questions uh, from previous exams and here we are going to solve. The first one is Sanya wanted to cut a cubical cake, a cubical cake into 120 identical pieces applying the minimum number of cuts. That's good. Later on, she realized that she paid she had to cut this cake into maximum number of identical pieces that is 125 so now she applies the number of cuts is so now 120 is 4 into 5 into 6 since the minimum number of cuts are possibly only when uh, all the three factors are very close so three factors are very close are here 5 5 and 5 so that is 120 5 but since 4 plus 5 plus 6 is equal to 5 plus 5 plus 5 both are 15 so hence the same number of cuts are required as previously hence n number of cuts will be required for this 125 cases also so n is the answer next one the direction is given as s1 is this s2 is this so with respect to every time it is going up starting from a new part uh, the given sequence is given Okay, so the last digit and the 10 digits of the sum of all elements of the first 21 terms in the sequence respectively. So in that way, S19, if we calculate, uh, or rather say, if we just forget everything. So if the first element of the, first element of the nth term, nth term, element number 1, n square minus n plus 2 by 2. And the last element, so this is the first element of the nth term. And the last element of the nth term will be n into n plus 1 by 2. That's the sum of the first n terms. So the last element of the 21 terms, 21st term will be 21 into 22 by 2. So 22 into 11, that is 241. So 231. And now find the sum of the first 21 terms we find the sum of the first 231 natural numbers so 231 natural numbers is 231 into 232 by 2 so this is 116 231 into 116 is 26796 okay hence uh, the last digit is 6 and the unit uh, tens digit is 9 So they have given it as last digit and the tens digit of the sum. So this is the last digit and this is the ten digit. Six, nine. Next question. The number of zeros at the end of the product of the elements of S19. So S19 is actually 172, 173, 174, dot, 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 190. Okay, so 175 will be 5 square into 7, 180 will be 5 into 36, <coughs> 185 will be 5 into 37 and 190 is 5 into 38. So the number of 5s, if I talk it about 5s, contained in the product of the element of the set of 5. So note that the number of 2s are more than the number of 5s. Okay, the number of 2s is more than the number of 5s. So that the total number of zeros at the end of the product of the element is 5. So answer is 5. Phone number question. So this is also associated with this, the power, just power of 10 that can be excessively divide the product of the first S19 and S20. So number of zeros in the product of S19 and S20 depend on the number of 5s, number of 5s contained into this. Okay, and remember that if 5 is there, then 2 is also there. So S20 is 191, 192, dot, 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 210. So two, 195 is, if I talk about number of this, This is 5 into 39. 200, 5 into 5 into 8. 205 will be 5 into 41. And 210 is 5 into 
42. So obviously number of fives contained in the S20 is 5. And hence the number of zeros at the end of the product is also 5. And at so the number of zeros at the end of the product of S19 and S20 will 10 zeros. The largest power of 10 is 10. So which can exactly divide the product of S19 and S20. So answer is 10. Next is question number 6. It's about a cuboid of dimensions 51, 85 and 102. Cube means all sides same, cuboid means this type of structure. It's first painted by red color, then it is cut into minimum possible identical cubes. It is cut into minimum possible identical cubes. Now the total surface area of those faces of cubes which are not red. Okay, so this is 51 first. <coughs> so that is 17 into 3. 85, 17 into 5. 102, 17 into 6. So the minimum possible number of cubes equal to 3 into 5 into 6. 180 <coughs> sorry 90 so now the total surface area of the non-red cube will be total surface area of all cubes minus cuboid so this is 90 into 6 into 17 into 17 minus 2 into 15 into 85, 85 into 102, 102 into 51. So 90 into 6 into 289 minus 2 into 189 and this will be 15, 30 and 18. So 90 into 6 into 289. 2 into 189 into 63. Still now we can't take much of carbon. So 289 into 18 is 5 into 6 minus 7. That is 289 into 18 into 23. That is the answer. So 11946 centimeters squared.